Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is the Oceanside Guys. Hey, everybody, my name is Derek, and welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, I have a brand new reveal for you guys. A new reveal, brand new. Not a how-to video today, but a brand new reveal. Can you see the big box in the back of the GTX? Can you see it? Did you see it? All right, that is the big reveal today. So if you're curious on what's in that big box back there, let's go check it out right now. Now, I'm super excited to share this with you guys today. I am super excited to get this on my ski and start using it right away. Let's get this box open and reveal to you guys what we got going on today. Handy dandy knife, let's get this thing open. Let's open it up. Ooh, looks good. And there it is. Super excited. Have you guys seen one before? Have you seen these before? I'm super excited for this brand new Super Rack for my 2023 GTX 230. Let's get this plastic off. So let's open up this part here. This right here is the back support for uh, the back of the rack here to attach to the back of the ski, which I will show you later in detail. But we've got this, comes with a U-shackle as well, comes with the bolts, washers that's needed to hook it up to the rack. It comes with everything that you need to get this situated on your ski. And I've got a 2023 GTX 230. And um, again, looking at the parts as I'm pulling it out, this looks really, really, really clean. Great job, Super Rack. Looks good. Okay, next part. This is the reinforcement base uh, for the Super Rack itself. And uh, here is just a quick peek. This will go right on to uh, your link system on the back of your sea -Doo. I will be showing you guys how to put all this together step by step. So there's that. We've got everything that's needed to put this thing on the ski. So let's do that right now. So as I'm looking at it, first of all, very, very well put together. So far, so good. I'm super excited for Super Rack to be on my ski. And so we've got all the parts that we need to get to put this onto the ski. So let me just kind of show you a little bit more in detail, closer up, of the different parts of this rack. So before I show you all the pieces and parts and the details of uh, the Super Rack, I just want to say thank you, Super Rack, for working with me and sending me this awesome, or should I say super, super rack, all the way from Florida to here, California, San Diego, right here in Oceanside. Hey guys, I just had to sneak this quick little video clip in here. I just got a special promotion code for everybody watching this video. If you guys want your very own super rack, you can. I just got done chatting with super rack, just got you guys a little bit more of a savings. If you wanna get your very own super rack for your c -Doo, for your PWC, you can. Stay in the end of this video and I will give you that promotion code for your very own Super Rack. So stay tuned. Let me show you uh, the details of the Super Rack. I'm gonna flip this thing upside down so that you can see underneath the Super Rack. All right, everybody, so what I've done here is I just put this on some cardboard, as you can see, uh, just to create some contrast. Let's flip this over and check out what's underneath. All right guys, so a quick overview from the underview of the Super Rack. So what you'll see here in the bottom, because this would be going on your deck, you'll see on each corner, they are padded right here on each corner. So I did not expect that. Uh, so that's very cool. I did not know those are there, so that's awesome. And of course, uh, to get it attached to your link system, you have this one side here where you just flip it in there, your lip here, and the other side is where you're gonna attach it right here. So you just lock it in, there you go, and you're all set. Uh, these are very high quality made. This is really put together well. Good machinery. Just to show you the detail, if you can see it, 
this is put together very nice. A top view, guys, just so you have it. Very nice, well-constructed Super Rack. And can you see that, guys? Made in the USA. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go ahead and attach it to the link system, and I'll do that really quick for you. And we'll just give it a firm push down there, and we'll get that locked. There it is. All right, that is locked and secured on there. Looking good, super rack. And I do have to say, if you didn't notice, if you're familiar with super rack, I did get the low profile rack for my ski. Um, so that's the one I opted for to get. And it, it really looks, it looks clean. Very nice, low profile. Absolutely like it. So let's give you some more details on the Super Rack itself. So I'm gonna show you the reinforcement system here on how it works, so let me show you that next. But before I do that, I gotta say, <laughs> that's really on there. Oh my gosh, that is sturdy. Okay guys, so here is the reinforcement base. So check out the bolts. So it comes with the bolts already, double washers on this side. And you got your washers on this side as well. And these are nylon nuts that come with it, okay? And this will go right into the super rack itself between the seat, the back seat, and the super rack, which I will show you how to do. And then of course, this will go right into the link system. It's already set up, connected, ready to go. Don't need anything to connect this to the ski, all right? There are some tools that you need, obviously. I'll go over that in a second. And here is the back support, guys, right here. So again, it comes with everything that you need to install it onto the Super Rack itself. So you got your bolts in here, washers, and nylon nuts. So all set, ready to go. This is your back support and also comes with the U shackle and uh, we'll need some tools for this as well too. But uh, there it is and I'll give you the tools here in just a second. And by the way, on the bottom here as well too, you're gonna see these uh, pads here because it's, again, it's gonna be sitting on the tail of your ski. So there's that. All right guys, so here are the tools that you're gonna need. You're gonna need a half inch for all of the bolts, okay? And then you're gonna need, for the shackle itself, you're gonna need a, a quarter inch Allen wrench. And that is all that you need to get this fully secured. All right guys, I'm gonna start with the reinforcement plate here really quick. I'm just gonna remove the bolts and then I'll show you how to put it together. So you got two washers right there, one small one and then one big one. Uh, the other side as well too, there is your nylon nut, small washer, and the larger washer. Okay, so just before we uh, put that together, let me just show you how it looks and how it fits between the seat and the super rack itself. Hey guys, don't forget, stick around to the end of the video to get your special savings promotion code for your very own super rack. Hang tight. Okay, so you'll see from the side view here that we've got a good amount of space between the seat and the rack itself. And we still have access to the cap right here for whatever reason, if you did need to take this off while it's just a super rack by itself. And then from the top as well. So I just wanna do my best to give you guys the best details I can when you decide to get one of these for your ski. So when we put the reinforcement base in, we're gonna be plugging it in right to here and to here. So that'll be super simple. And there's gonna be holes already pre-made to put this system together. So take a look everybody to see how this actually sits on the ski. So there is the link locking system right here. And you can see we've got quite a bit of clearance 
right above the deck here. And then these soft little pieces that are in each corner that I showed you are just setting right there and you'll see it. And from the back, you'll see here as well too, everything is just lifted off the back deck just a little bit. And these soft pieces will be sitting right here. So that's good design. And you'll see here from the side view, this is lifted up quite a bit. So I hope these minor details that I'm showing you help out a lot. Okay, so here's the reinforcement base that we're gonna slip right in there. So it goes in really easy. Just like that. So you just get that lined up with the link system here and we'll get the other side. Okay, that's in there. So we're gonna lock that one and this side will get that locked. All right, so all the holes are actually all lined up. So all we gotta do now is bolt it together. All right guys, so we have our washers and bolts and uh, there's a pre-drilled hole right here. So we're just gonna plug that in on this side. There we go, we'll do the same for the other side. Plug that in and let's get the backing on. Get that on there. And the nylon nut. So we'll just finger tight that for now. Nylon nut. Okay, and we'll just finger tight that on for now. All right. Oh, that looks super. <laughs> Nice and tight. Wow, okay, that's not going anywhere. Next one. Good, looks good. All right, so the reinforcement base is in. And I'm gonna show you a little trick with this here. So if you do need to take this whole system out, there is a bit of a trick. So hang tight, let me show you what that is. Okay, so I took out the bolt and took out the U shackle. And as I told you before, we got these nice two soft pads on the bottom and there's gonna go right here. So we have our pre-drilled holes, one, two, one, two, and this is where it's gonna sit. So we have our washer and nylon nut. Get those on there really quick. Just hand tighten those down really fast. And let's get the next one. And so the other side, washer, nylon nut. All right, and let's get those tightened down. We got them in, so now we need to get that U-bolt, uh, U-shackle in there, which I already undid this part. Remember, you need a quarter inch Allen wrench to take this out. So, we are just going to push this through. We're gonna add a little bit of pressure to kind of close this like a sandwich. We're gonna close it up, push it through, and there we go. So now we can get the pin in there, or the bolt. All right, once we got this kind of fitted in there, we're gonna make sure that we give it a little bit of a push up this way so that we can just drop this right in and get that set. There we go, we'll tighten it down quarter inch. There we go. And there you have it. This is now fully seated 
and double secured, very well put together super rack. I wanna go ahead and show you that one quick tip that I mentioned earlier in the video. How to take this whole entire thing off without having to remove every single piece. So let me show you that right now. So the only thing that you have to remove is this guy right here and the rest will just come right off. I'll show you how. That comes right off. That's the only thing you need to remove. So when removing the rack, you do not have to remove this whole support system back here. You don't have to undo these bolts. All you gotta do is unlink it. So we'll just take that one there, that one there, and that one there. Now check this out. So now that everything has been unlinked, the entire super rack will just come off. So as you can see, there's the whole super rack right there. And then you can just store it, put it where you need to put it when you need it. So when you're ready, you already have this attachment on, no need to undo it unless you want to. And you can just simply put it right back on. And just lock everything down. And there you go. Your super rack is super installed once again. Well put together, great accessory to any sea -Doo, to any ski. Great job, super rack. All right, let's take one final look at the complete installation of the super, <laughs> super rack. All right guys, that is it for this brand new reveal of the Super Rack. So stay tuned, look for the other videos that'll be up and coming soon on this Super, Super Rack. All right guys, as promised, here is that promotion code for you guys. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. Here it is right here at the bottom of the screen. Go ahead and use that promotion code to get yourself a little bit more of a discount when you get your very own Super Rack for your own PWC. Like, subscribe, share, and don't forget, Make today your best day, because tomorrow just isn't promised. And until next time, I'll see you on the water.